guys, it's Eric here with ToolsInAction.com. Today we're going to go over the Gorilla Grip. Um, I'm sure you've seen videos on it. Didn't they have a TV infomercial about it or no? Yeah, the guy that invented it was actually on like the Home Shopping Network. He was on a TV show or something. We yeah. met him at the show. He's a nice guy. Yeah, really nice guy. It's a pretty cool idea. I'm sure you guys have seen it by now. Um, basically made out of metal. It's got a nice rubberized grip here for your hands. And the concept of it is you can pop it right on plywood. Um, there was the info sheet on it. What, what do you need to know? Whatever. Go ahead. You pop it on plywood, drywall, and you can just basically lift it up. I mean, that's a pretty simple concept. You can lift it up and go. This is three quarter inch plywood right here. It's got its pros and its cons. Um, you know, I mean, it's the concept's nice. I do like it. It's very good for if you use it. I think it's better on drywall, personally. Why would you got to remember when you're lifting it like that, you're using a lot of your arm and your shoulder to lift it as opposed to if you just... As opposed to your back, yeah. That's... <laughs> no, but if you grab it, if you lift it, you know... You're using more of your back. I think it's awesome. No, it's a good concept, dude. But as opposed to if you're just lifting it up like that, now if I walk with it, I'm using a lot more of my legs. Yeah, and then what wind can work on top of the skyscraper and the wind can well, then you'd be carrying it with two guys, I would think, if you're out in a windy and dangerous con conditions. Okay. Aren't we about safety first? What's up with this fly, man? It, hit, it likes you. It likes your yellow shirt. Yeah. So, it thinks you're a flower. You know, for drywall, I think it's good, because if you're lifting, lifting like how I had it, you're going to end up probably bro breaking the drywall. It's got a nice grip on there, so it's going to grip no matter what you're uh, on, whether it's drywall, plywood, or whatever. Can you see it in the video? Yeah, okay. up a little bit. Oh, I got it. I can control it. Yeah, it's got a nice grip to it. It's made of some high tensile steel for sure. Nice yeah. rubber grip. Works like by can lever, canter lever action, sort of. Sort of. Okay. Yeah. So, the idea is good, and it's good for, I think, some applications it's good for. But, if, you know, if you Sheet want... Sheet goods, drywall, yeah. uh, up to three quarters, I think that one does. That's what this one is. Three quarters. Okay, so that's the maximum that it can hold. They come in different sizes. Um, you can check out their YouTube video. We'll probably post it also. Yep. So don't forget to take a look at our written review on toolsinaction.com. Also, don't forget to check out our uh, YouTube videos, our Facebook, and our Twitter. Yeah, because nobody could see you because it's just a blinding oh, yellow. Oh. Yeah. <laughs>